Hello there and welcome to American Theft 80s on Hard Mode. So we've completed the base game, the basic story, but now it's time to play the game in the way that I think it really uh, comes into its own. At least it certainly does with Thief Simulator uh, back in the day. So hopefully we will enjoy this because basically we have no story, no tutorials, and of course we're going to do it on Hard Mode. I say Hard Mode, it's Sandbox Mode actually. I should really call this Sandbox Hard Mode. Some sort of combination. Uh, but the objective of uh, sandbox mode is to collect all 15 VHSs, basically. So let's uh, go. And the, the hard mode, by the way, no mini map, no hard, so we don't have that little mini map. And uh, yeah, no markers for items or tenants. So this could be a little bit crazy. Now, for some reason, it's not letting me actually start this. Oh, right. I've already got a uh, hard on. <laughs> oh, hard. Yeah, Chippy 13 hard. Yeah, mate. That's it. Oh, that's loud. Let's go. Uh, so we've got to collect 15 golden VHS tapes, and they are scattered all around the map in random locations. And all the doors are randomized. The tenant routines are randomized. When I say the doors are randomized, I mean the lot types, and I believe it changes as well every three in-game days or something like that. I could be pulling that out my ass. I might be wrong. Uh, so it really is randomized. Um, so it's going to be interesting to see how this works. And we are, I believe we're going to come in with absolutely nothing. And we, I don't even know how we're going to steal our first like thing. Uh, I guess we'll have to go to that music shop and steal that tape recorder or something. <laughs> something like that. I don't know. All right. So, here we are. There's a VHS tape. Oh, right. Okay. So, these are the VHS tapes, the golden VHSs. They are all around, as you can see here. We've got five in the starting zone. We've got four here. Another three, four, five there, which must mean... Oh, there's one in the Mayor's Mansion. Of course there is. <laughs> so, we've got to work our way up to that. Uh, and we can do this in any order we want. Of course, there is a natural order. Where is it? I've given it a quick test run, so I know there's one here before, and I think it was like sitting... Hey, these routines are... So I think we have to go into our map to have a little look at their routines. Well, sort of. We don't know where it is exactly. I can't see it. It was out here when I did my test run. Hmm. Never mind. Uh, all right, the best thing we can probably do is go and steal from the trailers up here, which, oh, that has one. One, two, three, four, five, yeah, okay, great. So we can perhaps get one quite early on here. All right, oh, that, is it just me or is the sensitivity, once again, absolutely mind-boggling, horrible field of, no, field of view's fine. It's sensitivity in the car. That's a bit better. Alright, so we don't really know the routines here, but we're just going to go ahead and sleep until about 8 o'clock. And off we go. Glasses off. Yeah, glasses off. See how we get on. What have we got going on? We've got Boyo here. He is in the whole time. Oh, wait. We need our night stuff. Wait, I don't have night stuff. You have to buy it. <laughs> Excuse me. Right, there's some. There, there's sometimes a guy over here. There he is. Don't know if he comes in here anymore. Let's uh, see how we get on. Okay. We don't even have a spotlight or anything. Nine dollars. All right, we are rich. Let's retire. Got some cassettes here. It's apparently somewhere in here. It's a kettle, sure. Some old sneakers. Money. No, okay. Oh, there it is! Wait, where'd he go? Hoping he went in. Alright, other way, we've got the golden VHS. Sketch toy, that's a request item. We can get extra money for that, though it doesn't really matter at this stage, does it? It's all 
small change in the grand scheme of things. Uh, that said, we do still need money to get anything done. A couple of dollary dues there, and away we go. Okay. Oh, okay, yeah. Let's do that. Put. Out we go. Yeah, baby. That's it. We did it. Where's my experience? Give me experience. You do get experience for this. There we go. And you still need to discover all of your... Uh, you still need to unlock all of your skills as well. So, it's a good start though. Uh, yep, this is what I'm looking for. So, uh, we can do partial deliveries with our merchant over here. The merchant? What are you buying? So that's been delivered, apparently. I've got lots of stuff here we can steal. Some things for the kitchen. No frying pans? I can always find you some frying pans, my man. Trust me. No shortage of those around these parts. And as for you, well... Take the cassette, some old sneakers. So we can now buy some sneaking clothes. And a flash... Flashlight? I'm going to say a flashbang. Sorry, I've just been playing XCOM. So <laughs> I was like, why, why would I need a flashbang in this game? Uh, so yeah, you can buy everything straight away. Essentially. So that is kind of interesting. Uh, we, can, we kind of have to choose between the sneaking clothes or the... Or the hammer. I'm going to go for the sneaking clothes. I think they're kind of very important, <laughs> really, at this stage of the game. Um, right, well, at least we know we can steal that van at some point. Okay, so we probably want to go back there. Steal some more, maybe. We want to have a look at Zev 701. It's just one guy that lives there. But how do we get in there? I'm trying to cast my memory back, and I, I'm not going to lie, I don't really remember. Should we have a look? Have a look when he's out. Oh, someone's here. Someone's definitely here. Okay, 701. Yep, you're in. You are in until... I don't know what time that is, but you are in. Mm -hmm. Well, we can still a saucepan. <laughs> it's a million dollar ID. Idea, sorry. <laughs> Ring the doorbell, still the saucepan. There you go. Uh, let's go take a look at the music shop, see if we can still, um, let's see if our tape recorder is actually still out, you know. Hi there. That's a request item too. Stop right there! Crap. <laughs> Oh, he's coming after me! Let's get out of here! <laughs> okay, where's the, where are the police coming from? Uh, there. <laughs> what just happened? I'm so confused right now, but I'm going to just allow it. It's not safe. Oh, oh crap. Okay, let's just sort of chill here for a bit. Uh, you heard that. Back to headquarters. Whew. That was close. Safe now, yeah? So, uh... Ooh, $60. That was worth it. That was definitely worth it. I don't suppose you want a saucepan, mate, do you? No. 
You want a toaster and a slow cooker? They had slow cookers in the 80s? My god, what advanced technology. There's pressure cookers that everyone has now, isn't it? Uh, sure. 100. Right, we can now buy the hammer. I believe. So we can go bang, bang, bang on doors. Stuff like that. That's kind of handy, actually. That is actually pretty handy. Uh, what did we discover about 701s? That's after midnight, isn't it? We discovered that much. I don't really know what to say. This gas station. I want to know where this VHS tape is, because it was outside last time, and I wonder if we can maybe sneak around and... We put our sneaking clothes on. They're both just outside all the time. I mean, how do I not know your routine? I can literally see you right there. Hmm. I think you should still be able to get there, gather their routines. Must be inside then. Hmm. Okay. Well, anyway, let's go take a look at 701 and smash into the lamppost. I just can't believe what happened with that police car. That is the most. That is wild. <laughs> Okay, so there's not really much I can do with 701 at the moment. What I am thinking of is maybe some of the houses where uh, you can jump over the fence and perhaps get into the gardens and stuff like that. Like, I mean, look at you. Did I ever look at your house? I did in the previous. Yeah, I did. No, if you, if you, who's gardening at this time? Come on. That camera was never there before, I'm sure. wonder, I do wonder, if change into this we can grab a few more bits and I would love to get a crowbar. Someone sees me. No, they don't. I don't see anything. Got it? We out. We out. See, little jobs like that. That's what I'm looking for right now. You're a tenant, aren't you? No. Don't know. Uh, what about 703? These guys. These guys. Oh, now. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Do they leave anything outside? It doesn't look like it. There's a saucepan over there. <laughs> All this for a bloody saucepan, right? Oh, what was that? That was a quest item. Okay, let's uh, let's maybe leave it there. We've got a few items. Managed to steal from the gardens. Now I need to find my car again. <laughs> There it is. It'd be awesome to grab, like, that phone. But I'm just worried you're gonna turn around. Okay, that ain't happening. <laughs> that is not happening. <laughs> Alright, let's just uh, go back on the road here. Managed to grab a few more items. And keep it stealthy as well. Let's see if we can make a little bit more cash from all of this. Hello, sir. No, no, I'm sure one of them was a request item. Am I not reading it right? No, there's definitely no, no requests there. Well, that's fine.
Not a lot of money, is it? Is that another sketch of toy? Oh, that's why it's a request item. Uh, how much is the crowbar? 400? Eesh. Bro, are you serious? For a crowbar, oh my god. Can't be that modern technology, can it? Alright, so we're gonna have to think about this carefully. More carefully than my driving. Uh, I think 701 is the place to be because there's one dude there. I'm pretty sure we can use a hammer to get in. Somewhere, anyway. What about the police station? Ooh. Maybe. Maybe the police station. Alright, let's take a look at 701 just a moment. It's almost 6 o'clock. I think I'm going to want to uh, change to these clothes for now. Okay, let's, let's sort of have a little look around. Oh, I didn't actually look back here. That's the other half of the uh, sketcher toy, no? Whoa. Away we go. God, if I could just get in there. Oh. Oh, it's so good. So much stuff that we could take. No, it's almost six. Does he leave at six? Dunno. Uh, but I'm gonna go drop this stuff back. There we go, there's the other half of that. The teacher toy. Whatever that is. Getting a bit of reputation. They might be able to we might be able to get some jobs actually. I wonder if we can. Hi there. For sale. Well, apparently the wasn't the telephone one of the electro um electronics. I'm sure it was. <laughs> the telephone. Saying it like it's new to me. There we go. Can have that. Let's go say hi to uh, oh, good old Stax. Hey guys, you don't want any of me? You no, know, no, Stax, Stax. How you got something doing, for me, baby? Don't you? I'm good. How are you? It's been so long. But no, no jobs. All right. Maybe later in the game they'll have jobs for me. I don't know though. I don't know. Okay. Still not sure where to go. Okay, so he's still in. It's seven o'clock. We'll just stand here and look at him. Oh, oh, he's out for like one hour. Like now. Wait. That's it. He's out only for an hour, like which is one minute. This is going to be quick. This is a run in, grab, off we go. I mean, you shouldn't really use this door, right? We have a radio. This. Sneakers grey, they look better. Ah, uh, we don't need that anymore. What about those records? Is that still a thing? Grab more fawn. There's the iron in the living room. Alright, we've got to go. And that's it. That's all we can do this time. Let's close this up. Huh. Quick. Nice and hasty. <laughs> and then I guess we'll go in and take the rest of the stuff for uh, 7 o'clock tomorrow. Not bad, not bad at all. Uh, we should probably take a little look at the skills uh, right after this commercial break. Extraordinary, enchanting, tremendous, touching. Now E.T. comes home on video cassette for a limited time only. Own the magic of E.T. in time for the holidays. MCA Home Video, Amblin Entertainment and the Pepsi Cola Company are proud to bring you E.T. for just $24.95 plus shipping and handling. Then look for the $5 rebate from Pepsi, lowering your cost to just $19.95. A small price to pay for the most eagerly awaited video cassette in the universe. Order E.T. now. Call 1-800-835-7000. Alright, so we have no skill points yet. Uh, what are we going to prioritize? I think a mixture of sharp senses. I think sharp senses first, then backpack. I still like good endurance. We need all three of these. 
Not going to bother with appraisal. We're just going to steal everything that we can all the time, pretty much. Uh, but we can deliver those. I think that's it, though. Slow cooker toaster microwave. We've got to carry that. We only get one hour in that place. All right, what have we got for sale? Well, I've got... Well, mate, look. Look at this. Not too bad. Another... We're halfway to the crowbar. Halfway to the crowbar. Now, I know this road is for uh, pedestrians, but... Failing to see the bit where I care. Uh, where's 701 again? Oh, okay, we can drive through the trees. I wish I'd known that this entire time playing the game. Uh, we're gonna need to sleep till about 7 in the morning, although he, he's just sitting out there now. I wonder if... Just ignore me, don't mind this guy bumping into your fence and whatnot. <laughs> Just ignore it, just ignore it. If it's possible to sneak in while he's just sitting outside. Oops, sorry, sorry if I knocked the microphone there. Ah, uh, there we go, I think we're fine. Boing. Okay, we need to find that golden VHS this time. Seems like it's over this side. Oh, really? There it is! We got it. He's going to the... Shit. Hmm. <laughs> Why is he going to the bedroom? I could have sworn it says, oh, we just don't even have any more times. And we've got the VHS tape though, look, we got the VHS tape. I mean, that's at least something, so we've got two. <laughs> Golden VHS, poor. Look, we weren't caught though. He spotted me. But only just. So, nice, nice, we've completed this house in a way, I still need to like... I still need to rob it again though, I think, just to get some more money. Poor guy, he's going to be like paranoid. Uh, yeah, hopefully this guy doesn't recognise me. <laughs> so what was it, six in the morning? Uh, he, leaves, he leaves at... Yeah, and I think it's seven he leaves at, so we want to be there for seven o'clock. Alright, let's swing around here. Do my usual. I don't know why I didn't just drive straight through, to be honest. Oh, no. I wonder if I could do two loads really quickly. Like, you know, hop over in the car, throw the stuff in, off I go. Yeah. Alright, let's wait for him. Okay, he should be going now, no? There he is. Yeah, he's going. That's wasted like 10 seconds. Come on. Go, go, go. Like I can do two lots of this. Yeah, there we go. Alright. Let's go into the money room. Money room, give me money. Pricey, apparently. Wow, this guy has too many teacher toys. I am weirded out. Flat iron. Flat pan, rather. Flat iron's a restaurant chain that I've never been to, actually. They do cheap steaks. As in well-priced steaks, not like low quality, just well-priced. Ah, oh, hello, yeah, I'll take some of that. Uh, no, okay, uh, we've got... That's it, alright, we're gone, we're gone, we're out, we're out, we're out. No, wait, wait. Hopefully he doesn't notice the iron, having moved. And we're gone. Go, go, go. Oh, there's a fence here. Are you... <laughs> Crap, Jesus. <laughs> oh no, I've lost my car. <laughs> I'll have to pay for that. It's like $50 or something. Can we, can we do it from here? Oh, 
no. <laughs> I know I can do it from Raymond's. Is this... It's the boss, so I guess I'll take the boss to Raymond's. <laughs> oh, terrible. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Hey, dude. I suppose you got a car to spare, do you? How much for this van? It's like eight grand, isn't it? Okay, I didn't pick up anything. Okay. Sale. Yes, yes. Still not even close to that crowbar. Oh, I want that crowbar. Then we can really start breaking in. Let's see, is anybody here? Hi there. They might be. I'm just going to stand here and look at you. Or not. Hmm. Seems like there's no one here. Sorry, dude. Okay. Where are we? 704. Hi, Kevin. I want you to know I hate you, Kevin. That's all. <laughs> See ya. Hmm. What are you, a sim? Oh, hi. Ooh. Intriguing. Very intriguing. You're outside for the next number of hours. Well, that's 7.06, and I can't believe I've got to do all of this on foot. Ugh. Because I know this guy has a back garden, but I've... N he's, there's only one person here. The thing is... Okay. Hmm. He's gonna hum away. Oh, he comes out this way, doesn't he? Watch. Yeah, it's proper long the way he takes. Ah! Oh. Where are you going? This guy is very odd, isn't he? Scott. <laughs> I like to think it's uh, Dugster from uh, XCOM. His name is Scott. <laughs> Can't believe that worked again. Oh crap. Uh oh. Uh, we need to find a way out of here. <laughs> Uh, upstairs, we might be able to open a window. That's a pricey telephone, apparently. I know, I'm scared too, dude. Oh, we can. Can we, can we do it from a different... No. We do it from here. Can we grab anything else? Ah, oh, request VHS. Okay, hang on, hang on. Uh, we've got to drop something. Oh, yeah, obviously those. Okay, great. He's going to the kitchen. And we're out of here. Yes, we did it again. <laughs> I'm a sneaky one today. I think I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay. Uh, yeah, so luring him out, sneaking in behind him. <laughs> and yeah, just opening the windows from the top. That seemed to do the job nicely. Uh, I don't know if we're going to get the bonus experience, though. I doubt that. Oh, we are. I was super stealthy. Okay. Uh, yeah, have the VHS tape, baby. You got it. There was another one. Maybe there wasn't. Oh no, I think one of the things was pricey, which means we'll get extra money for that. We can always get the crowbar. In fact, I think after this, come on. Yep, we can get that crowbar. All right. Okay, uh, wait, uh, sorry. Do you mind if I buy it, actually? 
rather than just know that I can buy it. There we go. Okay, that kind of opens up, shall we say, that opens up a few windows for us. Not really any doors, but windows. You get it? I oh, know. It's a good joke. Uh, so where do we want to go then? It's these sorts of houses here, right? I think I'd rather go through them at night. This has a VHS tape. We've got 705 up here. Shall we see if we can shimmy the car out? Because running around everywhere is a little bit tiresome. Come on. Sh keep shimmying. Keep shimmying. Almost cleared the tree. I think we might have cleared it now. Ah, there we go. Got my car back. <laughs> Just... Uh, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Uh, Alright, 703 is kind of the house that's interesting me next. Uh, that said, I think going in at night interests me a little bit more. So where can we park? About here? Good. Let's reset it. Let's go 8 o'clock. Let's also change. Uh, what's the button for it? No! There it is. Crowbar, yeah. I reckon they've got some weak windows we can probably break into. Alright. Ooh. Hello there. Now, is there a key for this basement? Auto lock, lock pick. Lockity lock, lock locks. And who knows what they're going to do. Oh, hi. Yeah. You didn't hear that? Really? Very interesting. Do they ever go in here? Let's find out. Oh, yes! First time, baby. Right, then there's the VHS! Ha ha ha, we got it! We did it, baby. Oh, well, those requests, those are requests. The run man. Run man. <laughs> Derby shoes, yep, those are, well, that's one half of a request. I think we need two pairs of those. Uh, Sketcher toys are a bit whatever. No, nothing there that's any good. I and mean, this is just one room, right? Right, eight o'clock's not the best time for uh... Emma's going to the toilet. We might be able to come back then. Uh, where'd I park my car? Here. But when I, I've completely forgotten where I parked the car. For you see, I have amnesia, apparently, because I... Did I drive the car? Did I run? Okay, well, you know, I don't remember where I've parked the car, so I'm just going to... I'm just going to run along and, and, and do it my way here. Uh, yeah, take that. And deliver that for now. Okay. We just have to stay in the shadows. <laughs> Where did I put... Is it just in the car parking space and I ran to it? I think it is. Oh, I parked the car over here. Did I? Alright. I really don't remember doing that. But sure, whatever. Excuse me. Oh. Oh my god, dude. What the hell? Please, please, better not come this way. Crap. Oh, <laughs> oh shoot. Holy crap, we just ran someone over. Alright, let's get out of here. 
<laughs> oh, let's hide down here. Oh no, that was a disaster. I am, I'm, I'm one half all right today, and one half just dreadful, aren't I? Ah, God. Right, I don't know if this guy's ever out. It's not even worth going in there. Um, we've got some heat on at the moment. I think we might want to see if we can pull that off. It looks like we've managed to technically out... We might have outrun the police. Also, why did that guy, like, call the police straight away after I bumped him? It's a, it's a civil matter. It's not a, um... It doesn't deserve the criminal court. It's just a civil matter, right? Oh, dear. I don't know. Ah, uh, this is the 80s. Sorry, they hadn't really dis distinguished, uh... Between different types of law. Also, it's America, which is something else, isn't it? Okay. I think that's where we want to be. Uh, is it? It's maybe like here? There we go. In a sweet spot. Hey. Uh, let's try again. Oh, no. Actually, we're invisible anyway. Might as well wait and see. Mm, no, you know what? I think we'll sleep it off and we'll go there at the same time, like 8 o'clock tomorrow night. Sounds like a good idea. Alright, close enough. I'm, I'm flying. I am the Messiah. All of you must worship me. Oh, there we go. For sake. What? Uh, who heard that? Why did you hear it? Just ready to jump over if I need to. Doesn't seem like it's a big deal. Okay, I think now's the time to get those sharp senses. <laughs> yeah, now is the time. I <laughs> know. Uh, oh, there's those Darby shoes. Go down here. There we go. Right, right, right. Nice, nice, nice. So she goes to what the bathroom next or something? Uh, okay, there's some good stuff down here. Gonna make our way back. Something that maybe we've not got before would be nice. I see a load of cassettes. Ooh, calculator. Hey, you can go into space with one of those. Ah, oh, I want that. I want the other stuff as well. Alright, let's see what we can do. Shouldn't have taken that damn phone. Why have I still got that phone? Uh, uh, uh. Enough panting. Okay, let's throw all this in. Okay, good. <laughs> Can we get that guitar? It's not there anymore. Got some headphones. Is there some money? There was. Okay, let's grab these. Bloody Panty McGee here. <laughs> Disgusting. Okay, we're good. Right, that's it. Load number two. Acquired. Right, we are going to need our stamina to make it across here. Very good. Up and over. And out. 
Just like that. That's two loads of stuff. Or one in the big backpack. That's, uh... Okay, good. Alright, I'm going to leave it there for now. Uh, that's three golden VHSs we've gotten so far. Some more stuff so we can get some more money. A lot more experience. Did we get the S-Class? Yeah, we did! Baby, come on! Alright, thank you very much for watching. I will see you next week for part two of American Theft 80s on hard. And uh, the sandbox mode. I'm Let's call it sandbox mode. Thanks for watching. See you next time.